um, Ashley and I just found is an Echo label. It's fair trade for the rainforest. Yes. So the the packaging was made from wood that made the paper from not from the rainforest, but from wood which is cut down and re um, planted. And also fair trade label says that um, the people that made the product, the cocoa beans, chopped the cocoa beans and made the chocolate, have been fairly paid and treated humanly. And they're not just uh, using uh, child labor. Oh, but this is green. Mm -hmm. And what does it say? FCS. FSC. FS. It's made of 100% bio cotton, but it doesn't uh, say about the origin of the cotton. It doesn't refer anything about the package, if it is uh, recycled or not. And these are all F, uh, FSC, which means the paper comes from goods that are not from the rainforests. All of these are FSCs. Very excited about this product because it says that it's uh, from a sustainable agriculture. But now I'm having sec second guess because because we should uh, check maybe um, if it's misleading. Gradients. Yes, let's see. Uh, let's see. Uh, we'll find energy. something uh, ecological uh, about it. It's, uh, I suppose it's not, it's, it is misleading. It's misleading. Mm -hmm. So I'm not going to buy it this time. Not the design, every time. FC, FSC. Yes. FSC? Yes. So, what does FC mean? What yes. did I say it means? But the package is from. Yes, woods, but uh, not from the forest, uh, the rainforest. So, the wood that makes. We can recycle it. Uh, but the plastic, I think it's difficult to recycle. And uh, not from rain. This is an official, uh, official eco label, I think. Svelto, this brand, and here, same brand, have an EU eco label. So it's eco sustainable. Whereas other brands that are famous brands too don't have the eco label. Okay? But we found that this interesting the dog, food for dogs have any information about the package, the way it is, if it's uh, eco uh, quality, just the misleading that it's not cruel to test it, nothing else about them. In a, a normal supermarket, you'd find every day where you do shopping, and as we are used to, we walk into a supermarket, we go around and can't decide which product to use, because we do want to help the environment on one hand, on the other hand we want to save money. But saving money doesn't always mean helping the environment or the other way around. And a brand name does not tell us that it's eco-sustainable. So what we have to look out for, and we have um, compared many labels. This says, for example, there's no eco labels here, for example. This one here doesn't have a label either. But we found that many products have an eco label which are recognizable, 100% recyclable, or um, made from 100% recyclable material, but that doesn't necessarily mean that how it was produced was eco-sustainable. It could have traveled many kilometers to get here, and we could have polluted the air with air freight, or maybe the factory has been using, um, I don't know, machines that produce pollution in the air. So don't be misled. Lots of products are misleading. They have labels with um, green labels, so automatically you think they are eco-sustainable. Or they might have, like in this case, um, a flower, flowers or leaves on the containers. Not this case, but others. Um, so automatically we buy them because we think, well, they're made of natural products. So, or a waterfall, but that doesn't necessarily mean that they're eco-friendly. So uh, my message is to be aware of what we buy, and when we're in a supermarket, take a little bit more time to read labels and make sure you are really contributing to the environment. Thank you. Buy for labels. Be sustainable. Help the environment.